our last game we had just gotten our first treasure and dropped it off in the house and so now we're going to go back into the cave and see what else we can find so i'm just gonna zizzy zizzy say the magic word you feel a strange pulling sensation You find yourself in the debris room. All right, and I'm gonna, oh, there's something shining over there. I'm gonna go see what that is. Ah, it's the rod with the star. A three foot black rod with a rusty star on an end lies nearby. All right, we're gonna take that up oh, there's another tire or two I think this is a dead end so let's go back and we'll just keep exploring I feel like the rod is useful for something but I can't quite remember what uh, let me think I guess the good thing about all these games is they're not quite as action-packed as like a real like first-person shooter or something so you're never too worried about something leaping out at you um, I feel like hold on this bridge why do I black rod I'm gonna use the rod here and see what happens. A crystal bridge spans the fissure. All right. Let's save. That's great. All right, let's go over the bridge. Presumably, I can fall off there. See another dwarf. This little dwarf seems to be polishing diamonds. Let me, uh, just for... F Dwarf's axe. Use. Nothing happens. That is useless right now. Hmm. There's no use for that here. Nothing happens. There's nothing to do with it here. There's no use for that here. Why provoke a fight? Why provoke a fight? Why provoke a fight? What? Okay. Well, that, that's interesting. There are diamonds here. Ah. All right, I got some diamonds. Hmm. Don't really want to bring them all the way back, but uh, uh, let's just keep going. You're at the west end of the Hall of Mists. You're at the west end of the Hall of Mists. That passageway is very narrow, but wide enough for you. Hmm. What do I got going here? Whoa. You're at the west end of the Hall of Mists. You're at the west end of the Hall of Mists. What's my map look like? Okay, I could go north there, crossover junction. Looks like those two would join up. Miners, tunnels. Hmm. All right. Well, if I just go down here. You're at the east end of a long hall. There are two exits. Hmm. So it looks like... Down, I'm confused. The east end of a long hall. What's down here? Have I been here before? What is that? These seem to be mining tunnels. Hmm. 
where am I? I'm at the crossover junction. So if I go west, ooh, what's that? This is a dead end. Huh. This is a dead end. Darn it. Okay. This is a dead end. Guess I can go this way. Wait, isn't this where I came from? West, okay. So I'm just kind of going through all these passageways. Hopefully they're not going to turn into the twisty little passageways. Okay, where am I here? You're at the east end of a long hall. There are two exits. Kind of back where I started here. Hmm. So if I go this way, okay, now I'm back in the Hall of Mists. So let's go back the way we came from. and go over here, it should be in the other. I feel this is exactly where I was before. I'm so lost. Oh, how did I? Huh. You see a sturdy ladder. That's cool. I guess straight ahead of me is the dead end, is that right? Yes, okay. So let's just confirm if I go this way, I should end up in the Hall of the Mountain King. Maybe. No. Nope. Hmm. These seem to be mining tunnels. Okay, let me just go on this one. Ah, okay, so now I came back out. There's my gold. All right, so let's go. Which way? This way, because we. Ooh, what's that? You're in a low north south passage at a hole in the floor. The hole goes down to an east west passage. Oh, vaguely. Ooh, what's that? There are bars of silver here. Sweet. Ah, why two? It says, why two? It says, why two? Zizzy. Zizzy. Why two? It says, why two? Hmm. Jumble of rocks, Y2 room. Am I gonna run out of room here? Am I? <sighs> hmm. Let's 
that's where he came from. Maybe I want to run my treasure back. Okay. faster way. Zizzy, Zizzy, you feel a strange pulling sensation. You're back in the well house. Right. Up to eighty Black bars of silver. Up to ninety. Treasures here, right? Zizzy, Zizzy, you feel a strange pulling sensation. You find yourself in the debris room. All right. Onward! Explore the rest. Don't fall off the edge. Faster! Okay, so... Maybe you can fit through this small crack. You find yourself in the Hall of Mists after squeezing through a tight crack. Oops, so that was helpful. I should have gone that way before. Now can I get back that way? You can't find the crack you just came through. Okay, fine. Interesting. Well, at least I can get out a little bit faster to get my treasure. Oh, wait, what is going on here? Okay, let's just keep going. Okay, why do you hear the word plu? Huh. That was kind of scary. Okay. <laughs> That's a crazy light. Some dimwit cobbled that contraption together. Yeah, I think that looks a little scary. There's nothing here that you can use. Huh. 
Ha, huh, who could that be? The shadowy figure seems to be trying to attract your attention. That won't work here. Okay, let's save the game. Because I have a bad feeling. Can I go up and over? No. Okay, it sure looks like me, but let's... That's a crazy light. Some dimwit cobbled that contraption together. I wouldn't touch that. I wouldn't. I would. I, I wouldn't touch that. Come you could on. get electrocuted. I wouldn't touch that. You could get electrocuted. Come on. I wouldn't on. touch that. You could get electrocuted. There's no use for that here. That won't work. Here. There's nothing to do with it here. What happens if I turn off my brass lantern? Lamp off. You have turned off the lantern. It is now pitch dark. If you proceed, you will most likely fall into a pit. What, what happened to the, the light that was on? Hmm. Brass lantern. The lantern is now lit. That's a crazy light. So I wouldn't touch that. You could get electrocuted. Brass lantern. You have turned off the lantern. It is now pitch dark. It's too dark. You can't see a thing. I wouldn't touch that. You could get electrocuted. Darn it. Brass lantern. The lantern is now lit. Fine. All right. So I'm not sure what to do here again. I gotta get over. What's the map look like? Low window. All right, let's go back and go to the west. Hello. You're in the hole of the Mountain King, with passages off in five directions. You're in the hole of the mountain. One, two, three, four, five. Mountain King. I don't know if I've gone that way. Oh, man. This is a bad idea. There is precious jewelry here. This is an ancient tomb. This is an ancient tomb. To whom? So if I... Plu. Say Plu. Plu. That is useless right now. go back here and now see it clue clue you feel a strange pulling sensation you're back in the well house okay Hundred and two. I don't know where all this treasure is going, but oh, there it is. Okay, I better save. Zizzy. Plu. Plu. You feel a strange pulling sensation. You're back in the Y2 room. Good. 
All right, let's go back to the Mountain King and then we'll go in the other direction. Not this way, this way. New area. Okay. Yipes. You're in a secret canyon which runs east and west. It crosses over a very tight canyon 15 feet below. If you go down, you may not be able to get back up. This walkway is rather rickety. I'd be careful if I were you. Somebody's down there, too. A dwarf? A dwarf. This walkway is rather rickety. I'd be careful if I were you. Okay. You are above a tall east-west canyon. You see an immense passage to the west. You're in a secret east-west canyon above a tight canyon below. I like how it slightly changes to the descriptions depending on where you are, so it's kind of nice. The wide steps are blocked by a mass of boulders. So I guess I can't go down here. Oh, I can. No. Okay. Well, this looks foreboding. That looks bad. Watch out! A huge dragon snoozes atop a beautiful Persian rug. Dragon looks rather nasty. You'd best not try to get by. A huge, green, a huge green, fierce dragon bars the way. Black rod. Tasty food. Tasty food. Dwarf's axe. I'm gonna attack it. The little axe bounces harmlessly off the dragon's thick scales. Attack a dragon? With your bare hands? That won't work. There's nothing to do with it here. Congratulations. You just vanquished a dragon with your bare hands. Haha. <laughs> Unbelievable, isn't it? You don't want to beat a defeated dragon. It's had a hard enough day as it is. There's no use for that here. There is a Persian rug here. Okay. Where am I here? That's a crazy light. So I wouldn't touch that. You could get electrocuted. Where am I now? The rickety bridge. Another rickety bridge. Dragon room. Hmm. this 
Ah, that's where I was. There's the windows. There's something up there. The mirror is obviously provided for the use of the dwarves, who, as you know, are extremely vain. The mirror is too high to reach. Okay, so there is a way to get to the other side, but it was a mirror. Dwarf's axe. That is useless right now. All right, maybe this is a good place to stop here. Let me save it. That's enough for this episode. I'll see you in the next episode where we'll continue to explore Colossal Cave. If you haven't already subscribed, please hit the subscribe button below. Thanks for watching.